Hi there guys, this video is on Roman Reigns and his re responding to fans that were calling um, his leukemia a work, you know, like WWE storyline. Roman Reigns announced that he has leukemia and at that time he relinquished the WWE Universal title. We didn't know when the big dog would be back. Damn, that name still fucking sucks, but, um, but 126 days later, he made his return. Reigns had lost some of his size, but his hair was still full and didn't look sick. This sparked some rumours within the confines of the darkest corners of the IWC. That's the internet wrestling community, for those of you who don't know, which you probably all do. Um, and they were saying that it was all a work. While speaking very candidly with leukemia care, Roman Reigns addressed the mindset that some people have who say he never really had leukemia in the first place. I think there is ignorance of leukemia. The word alone is intimidating. Leukemia, it sounds like a cancer word. Yeah, I've got to agree with that, it does. It definitely it's not a nice family word, leukemia. It sounds like it could take your life, which it can. What people haven't realised is the different phases. That's the whole thing about me and this huge WWE platform. That's why I want people to know. I want people to understand that it's not what people see in the movies. We're in a different place now. We are making advancements. There are things we are d doing to help people and save lives. We just don't always concentrate on those things. Roman Reigns was very open to discuss the way that cancer is perceived in the media. Cancer is an awful thing, but Reigns wants to continue using his platform as a WWE superstar to show that it doesn't have to end anything. He can still take bumps in the ring after being such a terrible thing like leukemia. In the media, what we like to talk about is very controversial. That's what we want to discuss. We don't want to discuss the good moments or the wins. With my story and the help of my medication and the medical breakthroughs that we have, I think it's very important to understand that. We are winning some of these battles. There are very specific reasons why I am maintaining the look and the health that I have. And it's important that people know that. We are very happy that he's back on television every week. He might, he might not be wrestling as often, but he is still involved in a top storyline. In fact, Roman Reigns might be involved in Vince McMahon's favourite storyline. Because only the chairman knows what will happen next for the big dog. So, yes, since um, Roman's return, he hasn't been like as heavily pushed as he was before. He he announced that he had leukemia, but it it hasn't re but it hasn't really changed the way that I feel about the Roman Reigns character. I've not really seen much difference at all. It's still, to me, still the same moment. Uh, even though, while I am happy that he, obviously I am happy that he beat leukemia and he is back, back doing, and Joanna White is back doing what he loves to do. That's my thoughts on that. Oh, and also, I, I am definitely not one of those people that thought this was a work. WWE would have got so much heat if it was ever revealed to be a work that, like they've got all the stuff they do with like make a wish susan g coleman all the other charity work they do they would have had like a massive backlash if it was revealed all to be a work anyway guys if you enjoyed this video then hit the like subscribe and don't forget to share and i'll see you next time